My name is Navid and I live in Washington DC. Me and my wife decided to buy a home last year. Uh, we found an agent, we found a mortgage company. We started working with them. Initially, they wanted us to uh, put $12,000 down as a contingency fee. And uh, this, all of these things were new to us and we agreed to it. Uh, what we didn't know was this contract was written in a way that if we don't get our loan approved within 15 days, we have the possibility of losing this money. Just a few days prior to uh, the closing, we were informed that this loan is not going to go through. In a very short period of time, we lost uh, $12,000. So I was in touch with the lender and also the lender supervisor several times. I have sent several emails, I have made several phone calls, and they were all ignored completely. They either uh, I would leave a message and never hear back, or I didn't even have the chance to leave a message for anyone. Uh, none of my emails were answered appropriately. Two weeks passed by, and one night we were sitting and or watching The Daily Show with John Stewart, and the director of the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau was the guest of uh, Mr. John Stewart that night, and uh, he talked about this organization and uh, what they do. I looked at my wife, I said, you know, I think we should go ahead and complain and uh, see what happens. And that single night after the show was over, I filed the complaint online uh, through the uh, official website. The next day I got a response from the CFPB that we have got your complaint and we're going to work through it. I came home five days after and I had a package in my mailbox. I opened it up. It was a formal apology letter from the mortgage company with a check of $12,750. They paid for the inspection and the appraisal fee that I have lost in the process and I didn't ask for. They very formally apologized for what has happened. We were so surprised that we could have never thought this is gonna happen. I think it feels great. I'm an immigrant and I came to United States because uh, I thought this is a country that um, there are rules and regulations and the government is for the people. This is why I chose this country. This is why this country is probably the best place to live on earth. It's just a wonderful feeling to know that uh, there are uh, parts of the uh, United States government that are actually uh, their job is just to try to reach into people and help them. It's a wonderful feeling.